Hello and welcome back to another video. Today I'll be showcasing. Go away! Today I will be showcasing this. Um, this I got for my birthday. It is, as you probably already know, a Nintendo Switch. Um, and as you can see, the games I have on it are the following. Don't know if you can see that screen well, but. Yeah, so if I just go onto the home screen, um, so these are the games I have. Um, so if you look at this, you can see I have focus camera focus. So I have Minecraft, Pokemon Sword, YouTube, Super Nintendo Entertainment System, whatever, FIFA 20, Rocket League, Asphalt Mine. Mario Maker 2, Bendy and the Ink Machine, and Hello Neighbor. Um, all of these games are very fun to play, and my overall thoughts on the console... Well, I, I do like this console quite a lot. I, I was very excited when I found out that I was getting it, um, and it's just a brilliant console. Um, so, as you can see, there are so, two Joy-Cons on the side, we have the blue one. So um, I found out. So the blue one um, is for the left hand, and it has so it has a joystick and it has these arrows. Um, I found out that some people weren't very happy with the arrows. They preferred a D-pad, which is what is on most Nintendo um, controllers. Uh, it's on all controllers really um, and yeah this is the first controller on our right we have a red controller Can this controller can also be in various other colours depending on which switch you get or um, you can buy additional controllers um, so we have the classic uh, A, B, Y and X from the Nintendo consoles um, a joystick and we have the home button here by pressing the home button so I'm on my sc screenshots now by pressing the home button we can access a lot of things so press the home button and it brings you to the home screen or oh, oops I've just uh, pressing the home button can bring you onto this home screen um, it can so if you hold the home button down uh, you have uh, an, a menu that says sleep mode, automatic brightness, um, and you can control your brightness and your volume. You can also put flight mode on or off. Um, I, uh, this is optional in the settings. If you double click the home button, this comes up. This is optional. Um, and you can zoom in on certain things. You can lock the screen, um, and if you double click home, it exits this. So the home button is probably one of the most used buttons on uh, on the whole thing. Um, now, if I put these back on, of course, um, so you can insert the Nintendo Switch to a TV console but I can't do that at the moment because my recording equipment is charging um, where I would plug in the Switch um, and, I'm, and, I, and I can't unplug anything else um, but this is where I'm going to need my cameraman Emily Emily could you please pick up the camera be careful, I, I shall turn the camera around. Please pick up the camera. Um, and... Yes, be careful. Be careful. Okay, so this is the switch here. And if you put this in the dock here, as you can see, being filmed now, you put this in the dock here. And when it is plugged in, it will display on your TV here. Um, but yeah, it will display in a bigger, more quality, larger um, kind of screen. 
Um, now, I have went over some of most of the functions, but now I'll be showing you the things that I have done in the certain games. Um, so, um, I have completed Pokemon Sword. If you look here, this is me when I completed it. This was uh, when I got all the gym badges. And this is at the very end of the game. You get this, and it just says, the end. I don't know if you can see that, because this is in the way. Yes, it just says, the end. That's what happens at the end of Pokemon Sword. And this is what happens at the end of Super Mario Maker 2 Story Mode. You get this pixely kind of image. Um, now, I will be uploading a gaming video uh, sometime. Um, possibly next week, um, and possibly, yeah, whenever. Um, next week, most likely. Um, and yeah, this is the Switch. Goodbye.